My name's Grant Cardone. This is the Cardone Zone. Every day, every day, every day, every damn day. I'm gonna show you how to get money a lot cheaper than this. Hey, get yourself in a position to sit in that chair right there. Are you the solution or are you the problem? Yeah, well, we're talking about what does it take? They don't know you and they're not thinking about you. They, they do you. know you and they're not thinking about they you. They forgot you. My name's Grant Cardone. You are in the Cardone Zone where I wake you up, I shake you up, I punch you in the face, but mostly, I'm that good uncle. What's happening, Great Cardone? Yeah, what's happening, man? You got a deal or you got a question? Favorite day of the week, favorite day of the week, Friday, Cardone Zone, right here in beautiful Miami Beach. Uh, every Friday I come to you to talk about your money, your finances, and your career. Look, you guys want to walk into 2019? You want to, you want to, you want to, you want, you want the big Christmas tree? That's going to go away, by the way. Some of you spend more money on Christmas trees this year than you did your self-improvement. How stupid can you be? Then you wonder why Santa keeps kicking your ass year after year after year. Grant Cardone here. If you don't know my name, I appreciate you learning about who I am. And, and every Friday we do this. In fact, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, we deliver a different show for you. If you're on YouTube or Facebook, please comment. If you don't like me, please tell me you don't like me because I love that, man. It's just fuel. I dig it. I love it, okay? All right, today we got to talk about networking today. Uh, can you play the video? Can you play the caller from yesterday? How many times have you been to church? Zero. Charity events? Zero. Country clubs? Zero. Bank meetings? Bank meetings, zero. Uh, seminars? Zero. Uh, conferences? Zero. How much money is in your bank? Zero. There you go, bro. Your network. There you go, bro. There you go. I put that dude on blast. Guy calls me up yesterday. I got this problem. I got this problem. Dude, hey, how many times have you been to church this week, son? None. How many times have you been to a bank meeting? None. How many times have you been to a conference? None. How many seminars have you been to? None. How many times have you been to a charity or community event? None. How much money's in your checking account? Uh, none. Your network is your network. Moving into 2019, you guys have to connect with people. You got to make a commitment to a network, to build a network. I'm going to go to my little board right here, okay? Who's in your network? Most of you are so lazy about this network thing that you got a mom and dad. Your mom and your dad are your parents. They're not your network, okay? The woman that you married could be part of your network. I mean, your kids could be part of your network. You got four kids, two teenagers, two little ones. They're idiots. Your network is made of a bunch of people that don't know anything. They're like, hey, can I have a chocolate pudding stick? Like, that's your network, okay? If you're spending all day with kids, you become a six-year-old. If you spend all day with, with deadbeats that have problems with how much something costs, oh, Cardone's got a conference, the VIP seats, uh, 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 oh my God, there's so much money. It's $1,000 to buy a seat. It cost me $10 million to put the event on. 
Ten million dollars. You can't find a grand, okay? But you spend three hundred dollars on Christmas trees. You'd be much better off investing three hundred dollars at church, charities, uh, community meetings. This is not on your budget, and it should be going into 2019. In 2019, you know, I'm going to tell you the hard truth. In 2019, you guys need to figure out at least one church to go to. It should be a big church, too. Okay, just pick whatever your faith is and show up every Sunday and make sure you're on the front row. And make sure, and then get involved in picking up the money, being one of the, what do they call them, the ushers that collects the money. Start reading. Start reading. Let people see you, man, okay? Then you go, by the way, that costs nothing to go to church. Okay, go to charity events, find a big charity event or maybe six or eight or ten charity events throughout the year that you can go participate. Buy a big table. This needs to be in your budget. Hey, I, every, every couple months I'm going to buy the big table in front of the room. The community is going to see me. You got to get started somewhere building your network. Okay, if you tra travel around Miami right now, you're going to see about 30 billboards around Miami. It costs us a million dollars this year to make sure everybody in Miami knows my ugly face. Speaking of ugly faces, one just walked in. All right, community meetings. What else can you do, okay? There's three C's for you. Uh, 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 conferences, there's a fourth one. All these, probably these three, probably happen within your community, probably happen at in town. These conferences, this is where you guys need to get on planes and travel to where the, the, the network exists. Bill Gates does it. Just study the super wealthy. Study the Blackstones, the Jamie Diamonds that runs Goldman Sachs. Study the people at the top of the food chain. They've always traveled. Go back, I don't know, a thousand years ago. Jesus left his town to network with those that would listen to him, including he pitched people that wouldn't. So, so this networking thing, I know everybody says, oh, your network is your net worth and all that stuff. That's great. That's a nice little beautiful meme. Question is, what are you going to do in 2019 to build this? I'm putting a conference on. February 1st, 2nd, and 3rd. That conference is being put on so that you have a place to go to build your network. 35,000 people will ascend on the city of Miami, February 1st, 2nd, and 3rd. There's going to be people there like my landscaper that was here this morning. He's going to be there. He's like, I'm, going, I'm coming to your conference, man. I said, what ticket did you buy? All I can afford right now is like $495. So good, man. You bring anybody with you. I'm bringing my wife with me, man. Okay. You know, you do business with me. I'm going to support you. I see you around town. I'm coming. He's going to come. He's going to network with other people in Miami and outside Miami to get ideas for him and his family about how they can maybe build, build, build their landscaping business bigger and also how they can maybe start doing other businesses. We have people coming in from Russia, uh, Kazakhstan, Bulgaria, the Ukraine. We got them coming in from Orange County. We got them coming in from Los Angeles. China. We got them in coming in from Kernville, Columbia, Bogota, uh, Mexico. Steve Harvey's coming in from Los Angeles. We got Jesse Itzler coming in from Atlanta. We got uh, Bethany Frankel coming in from New York. Like I'm bringing some hitters in. This is the best speaking list you will ever see on a stage. 35,000 people, February 1st, 2nd, 3rd. Look, if you're not going to do this conference, then what are you going to go to? Go to Ryan Dice's conference. When is his, Frank? When does Ryan have his conference? February. February. His tickets are 1000 bucks, right? Yeah, he's at the end of February. End of February. After my deal, he's in San Diego. He's a digital marketing genius. Go to his. Go to mine and his. Uh, Russell Brunson's got one a week after mine. Go to Russell's. Go to mine, Russell's, and Dice's. I don't know what other conferences they have this year. Go to all of them. God damn, man. Leave your town, folks. Okay? If you were going to get rich doing what you've been doing, it would have happened already. 2019 requires you to do something different. That's our piece today. Hey, if you were going to get rich and famous, uh, you've had plenty of time doing it your way. 2019, let's try it another way. That means what? I got to go out. Jeff Bezos will get on a plane this year. Yes, it will be his own plane, and he will fly to Davos and meet with all the other billionaires. Billionaires hang out with billionaires and trillionaires 
And there are trillionaires on this planet right now. They're called corporations. <laughs> okay, that's who's got all the money. And that's who you're going to learn from. Okay, the website, uh, 10xgrowthcon.com, 10xgrowthcon.com. Super deals. Don't come by yourself either, okay? Network with other people. Networking is not something you do by yourself. You do it with other people. Frank Kern just walked in the house. I'm going to bring him in here. We're going to talk about networking and how important it is. He's a master of this, been doing it for years. My name's Grant Cardone. You're in the Cardone Zone every Friday. Career, business, finance, we bring it to you. Kick in the face. I was bored, I was lazy, not doing anything, sleeping, and not doing what I have to do. Grant Cardone changed my life. I want to showcase your success at Growth Conference 3. I promise you it'll change your life. When I met him, my entire life got better. He makes people better. He's a magnifier. so empowering, it was so inspirational, and my husband and I will walk away from this, the growth con, changed forever. I would say to you from all over the world, come to the next 10X conference. Wealth Dynamics believes everyone has the God-given right to own their potential. Most of us don't because we spend 40 hours per week serving the 40-year-to-life sentence, trading our precious time for worthless paper called money. We teach our clients to secure income so you can buy your freedom back and live a life of abundance and prosperity. Wealth Dynamics provides coaching, education, accountability, and community to help you build wealth. Join our coaching program, get educated on Wealth Dynamics University, and begin networking with the Wealth Dynamics Mastermind Group today. To get started, go to WealthDynamics.com. And... This is what I say, man. Have a place exactly. where people can gather, right? Exactly, yeah. Br make it a positive place where, where things are happening, and look who pops up today. Amazing. Frank Kern, had dinner with you last night. You did. That was awesome. It was great. What'd you spend on that dinner? Three grand. Three thousand dollars. Three thousand, but you know, I tell you what, I thought it was gonna get hurt. C. Grant yesterday, he's like, you like good wine? I'm like, yeah. He goes, you buying dinner tonight? I said, yeah. And he looks at me and he said, I'm about to mess you up, man. I'm going to hurt you, man. And I'm, I'm like, I was telling Natalia, I'm like, I'm worried about it. I oh, think, you, I, think he's, I thought I was going to spend like 20 oh, G's. No, no, no. So oh, I think really? we got, yeah, dude, because, no, you know. No, no, and, uh, yeah, I know you don't play small. I'm like, well, all right. You know, no, I said I, mean, I was buying yeah, but, 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 but I'm, I'm, you know, I'm very sensitive about money, so. Yeah. It was I, I looked down, I mean, one of those bottles of wine was 500 bucks or something. I'm like, okay, that's $125 a glass. Yeah. Four, four, basically four. But it was good wine. It was worth it all day. And the company was good. Your wife is freaking amazing. I know. How'd you meet her? At a conference. Swear to God, like you had Come no on. idea about that, did you? Did, you I really did. Not, did. I like, did not so know we're here that. talking about networking. Yeah, I did not know and that. Yeah, I met her at a conference. W like what kind of conference? It was, uh, the irony is not lost on me for this. It was a fitness conference. Uh-huh. Yeah, so I go to speak. You, were, uh, you, were you in shape at that time? Uh, moderately. You know, I mean, better than now. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I okay. was in amazing shape at that time. Greg. Were you? Yeah, I was actually in pretty good shape. Yeah. yeah. Training yeah. super hard, eating super clean, everything. Uh -huh. our, our main man, Bedros, Cooley. Oh, goes, Bedros was there? Yeah, it was his conference. He goes, we okay. speak at this conference? And I'm like, yeah, sure, man. And then, uh, you know, I'm like, why the hell did I agree to do that? I don't like going to conferences. Oh, my God. I've heard just, this before. I know. I'm not, we're going to be 80. Well, I'm going to be 80. Uh, you're going to be like a million. And we'll be in an old folks' home. You're like, remember you didn't show up that one time? We'll be like, I'm sorry. Nah, nah, I wasn't even going to bring it up. You oh, okay. So anyway, he's like, uh, he's like, yeah, will you speak? I say, sure. And then I'm thinking, oh, man, I don't want to speak. But I told Pedro I'd speak, and it was not in Miami. It was close to my house. And I remember <laughs> thinking, this is no shit really happened. Yeah, yeah. I remember thinking, what if I meet the love of my life at that conference? Like well, randomly well, thought that. Well, how, and how there many she years was. ago was this? This was eight years ago. Eight uh -huh. years ago. Yeah. Wow, that's Boom. amazing. Yeah. Every you know, in Bedros, I didn't know problems. Bedros. Yeah. I, I had you on the show mm -hmm. and Milet and somebody else, and, and I think you guys were all connected to Bedros. Yeah. And then the next thing you know, Bedros reaches out to me. Yeah. But again, we're talking about network. Absolutely. Like if I go back to the young Frank Kern, you mm -hmm. know, when you were surfing and doing that, th the, I told you last night, first time I ever saw you was doing a video with Tony Robbins. Yeah, big buddy. How, how, so how did you network? Like in, in, when you were coming up, how does a guy network when maybe they don't have any money? Like, Dude, I didn't have any damn money coming up, you know? So and they're, they're very, introverts. And, yeah, hardcore you're an introvert. introvert. Yeah, you're a hardcore introvert. Yeah, I know, man. Car I mean, if there's it. an introvert, this guy's the latest guest. I know. Guess. I know. I'm, good, I'm good at this, though, being on camera. I can be on the stage uh -huh. in the audience. It's, it's weird for me. Why, so, why, why do you think that is? Man? No idea. Uh -huh. Yeah, but I don't mess with it. 
Because like, okay, I work real well in this environment. Yeah. 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 The first yeah. event I ever went to was uh, Tony's um, UPW thing. Uh huh. You know, and uh, you went as a speaker, or you no, went as, man, a, and as, as an attendee. As an attendee, uh-huh. yeah. Didn't know Tony. Yeah. Didn't have any damn money. It was the first time in my life I'd ever flown first class. Like my little business was just starting to do pretty good. I uh-huh. think I was making like you know, maybe a hundred grand a year or something. I'm like, damn, I'm gonna fly first class. And I was, I really thought how, I was. What, a big were, how old were you then? This is 2001 or something, so whatever, the math is not an exact science. I was okay. almost 30, almost okay, 30 years okay. old. Yeah, so show up at that thing, join his uh, master university because he gave the greatest uh, pitch from stage. At that event, uh, met a dude named uh, James Scott who ended up turning me on to uh, some really amazing direct response copywriting fundamentals. Next event I go to was something called the Big Seminar which is, uh, this is way in the infancy of the online marketing. Uh-huh. Thing. Went there, and it, you know, again, as an attendee, there's like 300 people in the audience, made a lifelong connection there with a friend of mine named John Reese, with whom I've made millions. Yeah. You know, just. So he's uh, telling you, I mean, this, this guy's telling you, like, you gotta go meet people, okay? I'm gonna yeah. tell you, I went to a charity event in, in Clearwater, Florida, met a dude, guy later on, years later, sells the company, ends up with $4 billion, I was like, wow, man, you know, because I had that charity event in common with him, mm-hmm. I was able to go get advice from him and get a meeting. Yeah. That never happened to me in Lake Charles, Louisiana. No, it didn't happen to me where I grew yeah. up either. Right. Yeah. You, and you grew up where? Macon, Georgia. Macon, Georgia. Yeah. So what would you tell people, Frank? We got callers, right? Yeah. 305-865. If you want to talk to Frank, you got a question for Frank, call. When you call in, introduce yourself. A lot of people have trouble even knowing how to, like, how do I network? Yeah. How do I approach? How do you approach your wife? Um, <laughs> you just like, man, you are so hot. No. I got so to this have is, you. A, dude, this is so weird. This everything I, I know it's like almost a setup, right? But everything really does come back to networking. Uh-huh. The reason I met her is because she saw me in that same video that you saw me in uh-huh. with Tony, and a friend of hers who I didn't know comes up to me. I'm at this fitness conference. There's a bunch of dudes doing the you know take pictures with people thing, you know arm around the 75th dude by this time. And then this guy comes up and goes, my friend wants to take a picture with you. And I'm like, all right, you know, tell him to come on over because it's a fitness conference of uh-huh. all dudes and it's her. And I'm like, great googly moogly, you know. Yeah, and yeah. then I went full on, you know, uh, Facebook messaging, finally got a number, did the, the, your story with Elena is very similar to mine with Natalia, you mm-hmm. know, just nonstop. Uh, courtship, etc. Look, this is what I believe, okay? Because Elena's always trying to talk me out of the house, right? She's like, let's go do this. And I, first response always, I don't want to go. Mm-hmm. I don't want to go. And then once we finally do it, I'm on the way home, I'm like, we need to do that more often. Yeah. Do you yeah. do that? Absolutely. Every every time I'm supposed to like go to a thing, I'm like, man, I don't want to do this. And then every time I'm coming home, I'm like, that was pretty fun. And Natalia's the same way. She's like, dude, you, you're this every time. You bitch and moan and whine about it, and then you show up and you're like, that was great. That was Bring amazing. a caller on, but so, so when you come down to Miami for the growth conference, like, yeah. how would you, is there a recommendation how people should network? Yeah, just Can walk you, up and say, hey man, how's it going? What uh, do you do? You uh, know, what you need help with? Like, I've always had great luck, and I'm like really hardcore introverted person, and have this philosophy, like I never want to ask anybody for anything unless I've done something for them first. Uh, so a great approach that works for me is be like, hey man, what you need help with? Oh, dude, I, I can help you with that. And just like be cool to them because there's, uh-huh. a, you know, there's like a seven billion people on the planet or whatever. Yeah. And yeah. like maybe one half of a percent of them are actually cool to each other. Yeah, so yeah, if you're in yeah. that little one half of a percent, we just yeah. go up. Yeah. Nice I mean, to people. I know a lot of you think out there there's, you know, 35,000 people, a lot of people, it's a little overwhelming, but reality is it's like 0.00008% of the population on yeah. the planet. And everybody that's coming, they all have one thing in common. Like 10X is the common. It's not like these people are one X yeah. or like keeping to themselves. Going backwards. Everybody yeah. coming there is there to do this thing called networking. Let's mm-hmm. talk to our first caller. We got Vaughn in Iowa. Man, Vaughn, what's going on? Glad you called in. Iowa. Been there. Hey, hey thanks, Grant Cardone, for taking my call. Just so you know, the first week of January, I'm going to be down there applying ceramic to one of your staff's vehicles. So we can talk later about applying it on the plane, okay? Yeah, we, we can talk later about what? Applying ceramic to your, your plane. Applying what? Ceramic on your plane. Dude, I like to put some ceramic on my plane. Yeah. 
Okay. Absolutely, man. Yeah, you're going to love it. Yeah, I'll be down there the first week. Where do we put the ceramic? Where, where do we put the ceramic? Where does it go? Inside and outside of the vehicles. I mean, oh, yeah. anything but you know, not edible. That's about it. Don't eat the ceramic. Well, we, yeah, we're going to talk about that later. I'll be there the first week of January. Yeah, well, let me ask you this. Are you, gonna, are you coming back for the growth conference February 1st, 2nd, and 3rd? Absolutely. Of course. You got your ticket yet? I'm getting it today, actually. Motherfucker, you better get it right now. <laughs> you need, I got it. Get him ceramic seating. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Get him some ceramic yes, seating. Is ceramic expensive? Absolutely, <laughs> sir. This is something that Thank you. nobody is really promoting. And I mean, as far as your plan goes, you want to talk about saving costs on fuel? Yeah. No, we don't we'll worry about the cost later. of the fuel. I told Frank last night, he's like, what's it cost to fuel that thing? Yeah, what's it cost an hour? Grant literally said, I don't know. I said, no, the plane's no <laughs> good without it. Man. plane's no good without the fuel. Hey, you guys, your yeah, money's, exactly. your, your business won't grow without a network. Like, what does it matter what it costs you? Oh, my God, I don't have time. You, you don't even need time. You don't have a network. I like being on your show because I can say things I normally wouldn't say to people. Yeah. The, is it really only 300 or $400 to come to this thing? It's what, uh, what, what are the tickets, 495 I think it's four ninety five. People are talking about the money. I'm yeah. like, motherfucker, it's uh -oh. 2019. You watching this shit on your thousand dollar iPhone on your three hundred dollar a month? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah it's yeah, like yeah, you yeah, got yeah. the damn money. You got the Good money, bitch. And if you Come don't on, have man. the money, guys, if money's a problem, you need to go where money gathers. And they're going to be there for three days with great people. And I know everybody's uncomfortable, but so what? Let's blow up 2019. Stay with us. We'll be right back with the great Frank Kern. Good looking, too. How do we start marketing this? Do we scale back? The number one thing you have to do is promote. Doesn't matter if you have a fifty thousand dollar business or a ten million dollar business. It gives you the same attention. After listening to you, I went from zero dollars to almost five million in net worth. I need my profit margin where I need it to be, and it's not there. My name's Grant Cardone. This is the Cardone Zone. Every day, every day, every day, every damn day. I'm going to show you how to get money a lot cheaper than this. Hey, get yourself in a position to sit in that chair right there. Are you the solution or are you the problem? Yeah, well, we're talking about what does it take? They don't know you and they're not thinking about you. They, they do you. know you and they're not thinking about you. They forgot you. you. My name's Grant Cardone. You are in the Cardone Zone where I wake you up, I shake you up, I punch you in the face, but mostly, I'm that good uncle. What's happening, Greg? Yeah, okay, what's happening, man? You got a deal or you got a question? How about we Hey, welcome back, Grant Cardone in the Cardone Zone with the great and beautiful <laughs> What he calls himself. He damn right. Uh, Frank Kern. Every, mm. uh, there's a good dude right here. Mm. Hey, on the break, on the break, we're talking about uh, 10X Growth Conference. Frank, you, you show up for a conference like this, okay, yep. with that many people. Well, what are you looking for when you walk in there? That's a great question. You should, I think anyone should ever go into any situation with that primary question, what is the outcome of this experience? Uh -huh. I go there for three outcomes. Number one, observation. I mean, anyone that wants to sell anything should go and observe, holy shit, this dude just literally went from three years ago you did your first event? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. from never having done an event like this to having literally the biggest event like this ever in history. So number one is like, just watch. I am the greatest. Just watch. Second greatest. Just watch. You know what I mean? Yeah, so yeah, that's yeah, thing number yeah. one. That's cool. That's cool. Yeah, that's good to point. learn learn by modeling. Thing number two, learn from the dudes that are there. I mean, uh -huh. you ain't got no dummies up in there. Right. Yeah. Like, that's... A lot of really, really smart people talking. Not only listen to what they're doing, but watch what they're doing. Mm -hmm. You know, so I'd like to take that dual, that dual path thing. And number three is to meet like-minded people. You can't, 
Like you got two types of people in the world. I guess there's three types of people in the world. There are types of people that will drain you, there are neutral, and then there are the types of people who will energize you. Most likely, this event is going to be filled with yeah. 35,000 people who will energize you. So I think it's physically impossible yeah. not to go there and come out with mutually profitable connections unless you deliberately try not to. Yeah, yeah. and the further people travel, the more energizing they are. Like, I mean, I'm gonna tell you, I've, I've learned, like in the last couple of years, I've learned so much from international people. We just left London that it was an extremely expensive trip. Like it was like to, to travel with the whole posse, bring them over there for two weeks, like it, very, very expensive. The connections and networking that we made because we invested time and money brought us more time and money. So if you're having a problem, because the only two reasons you won't come to this is this. I don't have time and I don't have money. I don't have time and I don't have money. And I'm, I'll promise you this, in 2019, and then we'll bring some callers in, if you would start investing more time and money, you will end up with more time and money. Frank's moving down to Miami just so he can be next to me because he knows that together we can make more time and money. That's right. We can make. We can make yeah. more together than, than, of than apart. Of right? course. We'd have to physically okay. almost try not to. Yeah, to, I mean, the killer whale, killer whales stay in pods. They, yeah. they, they travel together. They hunt together. Yeah. They feed together. Like, like, you guys are trying to do everything on your own. You don't need to. I made yeah. that mistake for so many years. And I every too. year. Because I thought I was a competitor. I thought I had to compete. Not yeah. collaborate. Yeah. I didn't even understand the concept. We were talking about it uh, yesterday. That, like, there is no zero sum game yeah. in business. And it's yeah. more fun, by the way. It's yeah. more fun to have people uh, uh, with you, okay? So, look, uh, uh, 10xgrowthcon.com forward slash VIP. That's where I, where I really want you guys to decide to, to sit before, the, before Christmas. 10xgrowthcon.com forward slash VIP. If you've been watching me for years, if you want to support, maybe you want a ticket, maybe you want one for somebody else, maybe you just want to support Grant in the endeavors I'm doing. I was telling my wife the other night, I said, you know, I got this guy, I know this guy following me, I'm upset. I asked this old friend of mine, I'm like, are you coming to the conference? He's like, no, I wasn't planning on it. I'm like, hung up the phone, no problem, whatever. And, and Elena's like, what's going on? I said, dude, it'd be nice if the people that are friends and family and been around a long time would support me in the new things I'm doing. Like, a lot of your network is not supportive anymore. It's dead branches. That's that middle, that neutral. Yeah, that neutral. I don't think yeah. neutral is neutral. I think neutral is like literally sucking life out of you. It's drag. Quietly, the not, not, yeah. they're not vampires. They're not causing problems, mm -hmm. but they're not doing anything. They're dead branches. Yeah. And they sit and they, you need to cut, chop them off so the cheap tree can grow. That's what networking is about. Networking is about, hey, I gotta, I gotta rebuild my little empire network so it's strong. Let's talk to somebody. Maybe you got a question for me or Frank. You got James in uh, Staten Island. James from Staten Island, have you gotten your 10X Growth Conference ticket yet? Hello. Yo, man. You have you gotten your seat yet? Hey, hey what's up, Uncle G? Come on, man. I can't believe I'm talking to you. It's so unreal. Uncle G Your and Grandpa Frank. <laughs> <laughs> it all depends on how much that seat costs, buddy. Dude, no, 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 no. Have you gotten it yet? No, I haven't gotten it to answer your question. What's wrong with you, man? Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> Dude, how long you live in? <laughs> hey, how long have you lived in Staten Island? My whole life, born and raised. Yeah. Fortunately. Yeah. Well, you know what? How how old are you? Thirty years old. Last year, in the last 12 months, how many conferences did you go to? Um, one, and I'm trying to think of his name. Please forgive me, tall guy, big hands. Uh, um, Tony, big buddy. Rob, um, Tony. Tony Robbins. Good, good. Now that you're motivated, now that you're motivated, come to a conference where you can learn some skills and strategies. Yeah, absolutely. I got your book, Sell It, Be Sold, and I was watching your live feed with um, that handsome gentleman that you got sitting there with you. Yeah. And I, I agree about everything that you guys, you know, network is key and everything. You know, yeah. I had actually sent you a, a live video, Grant, uh, to Jared's email. You know, my daughter, uh, she's a cancer survivor, so I go to big charities with millionaires and billionaires. And I was sure that, you know, when I gave a live testimony in front of all these people, that I gave out my business card to the guy that owned the Lincoln and Ford dealership and the guy that owned the Mercedes-Benz dealership. You know what I mean? Yeah, I like that. Yeah. I, I like that. Hey, so, so look, look, this is what I'm going to do for you, all right? 
Uh, you want to bring your you want to bring your daughter to the conference? Yeah, that would be awesome. Okay, good. So you can go go to Grant Card or go to 10xgrowthcon.com forward slash VIP. Yep. You're going to sit on the field with your daughter and her seats free. That's awesome, Grant. I appreciate that. Okay, her seats included. Uh, you need to grab it now, or you need to talk to Natalie. And then, and then I'm going to okay. get Kern. I'm going to get Kern to give you one of his direct marketing uh, programs. You know, I think I got something better. I'm going to give you all of my direct marketing programs. What What do you do? What do you do oh. for work? What do you do for work, dude? I actually work for Mattress Firm. Okay, good. He He could use what you do. Absolutely. Yeah. If you only assuming he wants more people to come in and ask him to sell a mattresses. Can I have a mattress? Yeah, that's what that's a lot of margin in mattresses too. I just bought yeah. one. Nice. I got to buy a whole bunch of them moving down here. Yeah. So yeah. what are you going to do for him? I'm going to give him all my stuff. Everything what, what, I got. What, what, what is that? What, what are you called, giving him? I have a, a package called the Legacy Collection. It is literally every course that I made and sold since, I want to say, 2008. If you add up the value that people actually paid, not this manufactured, you know, stuff, but like added up the actual retail price that other humans paid for this, it would be $53,000. You can have it today for the low, low cost of $0. Dude, he's going to give it to you, bro. So... Yeah. Hey, you got to take advantage of the gift. It's not free. By the way, you got to spend something. You're going to have to get a hotel. You're going to have to get a plane. You're going to have to fly down here. There's plenty of reasons not to come. Oh, my God. God damn, I got to get on a plane. Oh, it's February 1st. Oh, I'm not going to be able to get up for it. You guys can come up with all the excuses you want, but that ain't going to build your network. Kern's going to give you $50,000 worth of goodies. Everything he's done since 2008 to make this guy a living legend. Anybody can become a legend after they die. I mean, that shit is easy once you're dead. This dude's a legend and he's still alive, okay? I know he's a legend because he's sitting next to me. I done told you so. And that's all I want to do is sit next to legends or the next legends, okay? I'll grab the VIP seat for you. Anybody else that wants to call in right now and take advantage of this offer, uh, call Natalie, 305-865-8668. Let's talk to our next caller. Congratulations to our last caller from Staten Island. My man. By the way, if you've ever been to a Tony Robbins event, folks, this event will blow your mind. I love Tony. Good friend of mine. Uh, uh, Kern's done stuff with Tony. This is not a Tony Robbins event. If you've been to a Tony Robbins event, this is not a Tony Robbins event. The people that are going to be here, have already, they're already motivated. You've heard, you've heard my audience. They're already motivated. Probably half of them have already walked on fire. Now they want to fly. Time to get it on. Now they're like, I want to fly. <laughs> that was beautifully done. Huh? Beautifully done. They want to fly, dude. Yeah. And to fly, you need strategies. When the <laughs> event's over on February 4th, you need strategies. Okay, I'm going to make extra money this year. What do I do with it? How do I do it? Why you do I do it? You tell people you Let's walked in here yesterday down. and what you did with some of your money? Oh, I gave it to you. I walked up in her. I said, Grant, take my damn money. And uh, dumped, his reti- dumped his retirement account that he's been feeding for years. Yeah. It's been okay. sitting in cash, not even in the markets, because I'm like, I don't believe that crap. Yeah. And put it into the fun with you. And the reason I put it into the fun with you, A, I trust you. B, I know exactly what you're saying is true, which is these assets are hard. Yeah. C, man, you put money into like, I don't know, uh, Pfizer or something, and Pfizer starts to go, get a little funky, nothing you can do about it. One of these apartment buildings get a little funky, I can write some ads for that thing. Yeah, we just you know, that. Just I can I can get the I can get the tenants to come in there my damn self. Yeah, yeah. So, we so we're going to be working on that. that actually. Okay, so he yeah. invested money in the fund yesterday to to uh, as as an investor, a partner with me in the real assets. Okay, that's what we created at, at our at our Cardone Capital, CardoneCapital.com. By the way, the response to that opening of the non-accredited has been like biggest thing I've ever done in my whole career. Because I'm serving you guys. I'm giving you guys what you want, man. So again, February February 1st, 2nd, 3rd, 2019. You're going to make more money next year. What are you going to do with it? Where's it going to go? How are you going to advertise? How are you going to market? You see this guy's Facebook. Look, look, Look at some of the campaigns he's doing on Facebook right now. They're brilliant. I was watching one of your ads today. Works pretty good. That's his deal. It pretty, works pretty, pretty good. good. It's crushing it, dude. That stuff we're doing right now. Right. 19 years I've been in this game. I've never yeah. seen anything as powerful as the stuff yeah. we're doing right now. It's Magnetic great. advertising. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They're ready. They're ready to buy before you Bring even them ask you. them. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Next caller. You got Hyman in New Mexico. Hyman, Grant yeah, Cardone, Frank Kern. How you doing, brother? How's it going, Grant? Man, going, good. Man? It's going good, man. Say hi to my friend, Frank. 
Hey, Frank, how's it going? All right. I met Grant in 1999 in Lubbock, Texas. A uh, dealership sent me over there to meet him, well, to train, and I, 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 the reason I wanted to get on here is talk a little bit about networking. I met you in 99. I went back to the dealership, and the management didn't go learn from me, so they didn't let me use any of the things I learned from you. So anyway, to make a long story short, i followed you ever since. I uh, had a car dealership, lost it in, the, in 08, went back to school, got a degree in graphic design, worked for a few magazines. And I was looking online for somebody to train with uh, how to sell ads on magazines. The only thing that came up was Grant Cardone, so I started following you again. And uh, what's funny is, is I became an ambassador last year on the GrowthCon because I saw the first GrowthCon. I bought it and watched it at, a, at a, my office, and I was like, man, I need to be there. Yeah, I and need to last be there. Year, last year I went to the Vegas, went to the Growth Conference, I met so many people networking that, well, I'm going to tell you what's funny, man. I'm out there introducing myself to people out in the hallways and stuff, and you guys put me as on on the big screen. I was up, I didn't know I was on the big screen. So I come back in, and the lady that I was sitting next to, she wouldn't talk to me at first. So I come sit down, and she looked like, you inspired me. I go, well, what? And he goes, you inspired me. I go, why? You were on the big screen. I go, I was on the big screen. Yeah, your video that you made for ambassadors. Because we made that first video, then we made the second video. But I kind of cheered up because you brought me out of my hole, man. Yeah. I lost my dealership. I thought I was nothing. I'm working for a newspaper, and the ambassador program changed my whole life. Yeah. I got. I'm with another company now that uh, we do 3D tours. So my my website's 24/7 open homes. But I'm working with the guys across the nation. But the reason is. Because I'm networking through you. You yeah. showed me, again, how to do it. Dude, that's awesome. So I mean, I, at, hey, hey, if you book your seat for uh, February. Yep, I'm in the executive section. I did the Black Friday thing. And then Chelsea uh, Hotchkiss, she owns First Insurance. She's one of my clients. Um, we got her a ticket, so she's going also. So, Dude, that's yeah. awesome. That's awesome. Okay, this guy's telling you, what he, he went to our conference last year. By the way, I've told my video guys, this year our screens, our video uh, package, our wall behind me is three times bigger than it was last year. I was just with my video guys yesterday. Johnny, come in here real quick, Johnny. Bring your little ball head over here. So la yesterday I was in front of Johnny. I said, Johnny, from 6 a.m. in the morning, that's 150 feet by, by 60. That's 9,000 square feet. That's twice the size. The video screen is twice the size of my home. Damn, that's a big ass video screen. Okay. Mm -hmm. I said so from nice. 6 a.m. in the morning, I told Johnny yesterday, till 6 o'clock at night, if there's one person in the room, that video screen is lit up the entire time, either with somebody delivering instruction on how they can blow up their 2019 or some of the audience that's there that's learning. So you're going to see people. Like more than our speaker list, you're going to see people getting on stage tell, telling success stories about 10X. So, I mean, this thing is going to be like, we've done two of these now. We think we, we're, we're starting to groove in and on what we're doing. You'll see Frank Kern walking around. His beautiful wife's going to be there. There's going to be celebrities all over the place. We got influencers coming in like, man, I know you didn't pick me to speak this year, but I'm going to be there in the audience anyway. So... Uh, make sure you get to be part of this. Hyman's already hooked up. That's fine. That's My fine. man. He are, he's, he's good, okay? Frank Kern is going to give you his entire digital program. All of it. Ten, what is that? Ten years worth of stuff. $53,000 worth of stuff. Can I make he's this offer now? Yeah, make it. Do it. Do All it. right. So do what it. time let's is see, it right now? It let's is, see how many uh, seats we can sell right now. 305-865-8668. Let's see what Frank's got. 1240. This expires at midnight tonight. What's the date? 15th or 14th of December? Uh, so at midnight on December 14th, this is over. You guys will timestamp the orders. Here's what I'll do for you. Incidentally, I get no money from this. Don't want your money. I gave him my damn money. He does want All your right. money, but no, no, I don't want yours. He'll get yeah. it later. I mean, I'll take it. I'm gonna get it. Don't worry about yeah, it. He yeah, does. he. This guy's in good shape. Here's the, here's the offer. All right, you get any ticket at any price. You can have everything I've done. You can have my complete legacy collection. That is literally 53 thousand dollars worth of training it includes mass control which is a legendary iconic training sold out about 10 million dollars of that program sold santa kern is what they call me right now 
Yeah. List control shows you how to attract followers, how to sell to them. Mass conversions shows you how to create magnetic campaigns, have people coming to you saying, hey man, can I become a client? If you're in professional services, you get my advanced consulting class. That originally sold $7,800. You get Project Free. OTF, $10,000, never advertised, sold uh, one time ever held alive in Las Vegas for people that sell high ticket. Everything I've done over 10 years, yours, zero dollars, but here's where it's gonna get significantly better for you. Uh -oh. If you'll notice right now, there is a pretty, pretty good absence of terrorists in the United States running around blowing stuff up. That's because of the United States Special Forces, specifically the United States Navy SEALs. My wife and I support a charity really heavily called Honor.org. Honor.org takes retired officers from the U.S. Special Forces, brings them up to speed in business, and introduces them to the business society. I have Honor.org uh, graduates that work in my company. So every single one of you who purchased a ticket, my wife and I will write a check in your name to Honor.org for 100 bucks. You're helping yourself. Wow, that's awesome. And you're helping that's your awesome. country. Let's get it. You have no excuses. You're not going to get a better offer than this. Let's go. Sign up today. I'll hook you up. Okay, 10xgrowthcon.com forward slash VIP or 10xgrowthcon.com. If you don't want the VIP seat, 10xgrowthcon.com. You can just pick out whatever seat you want. He'll include his package and $100 goes to uh, his charity in your name, by the way. In your name. Okay, you are directly awesome, helping dude. the U.S. That's Special awesome. Forces. Right. They helped us. Um, seats are Diamond, VIP, Premier. I mean, these are, these are Mac Daddy. I, I, I'm doing my part to put the, the gig together. My check's 10 million. You decide what you want to invest in yourself, who you want to sit with, what you want to do. February 1st, 2nd, 3rd. Guys, you guys and gals, you need to book your seats now and start working on your hotels and your flights later. Do not worry about that right now. You got to grab your seat. You're going to run out of time. This will be a sold out event. event. And he's just giving you 50,000 50, more reasons plus uh, to help uh, military, he's just giving you a lot more reasons to go ahead and pull the trigger. Let's talk to our callers. All right, we got Yogi in Nashville. That's very generous of you guys to do that, man. Well, yeah. Okay. Hello. Yogi, how you doing? I'm in the Cardone zone. You in the zone? You in my zone? What's it like I'm to be so in my zone? To be on, on the phone with you. Good to. Uh, good. Listen, I won't take much of your time. I know you work at uh, in the speed department because you like speed. So I know today's topic is network marketing. No, I'm in the real estate industry here in Nashville. I'm in the procurement business. I procure any kind of real estate deal for any investor. And I want to be I'm procured. <laughs> procured, that's right. Hey, but let me just tell you, we're talking about networking, not network marketing, even though I love network marketing. No, 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 not network marketing. Networking, yes. yes. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. yeah. You, I, I understand the topic. This is my focus, and uh, my goal today is I have uh, I've been to three seminars with three different attorneys uh, uh, explaining the new opportunity zone. So my question to you pertaining to network, networking is what would you advise me or how would you advise me to uh, in the networking department that I can go out and find all the information so I will be a better, I will be an asset to you and all of my investors. Well, you got to get closer to those people, me or the investors, right? You got to get like everybody's trying to do the Facebook, Instagram thing. That's great, but you got to, you got to, I mean, money, the distance between you and the money is an issue. You agree with this? Yeah. You have to close the distance. So at some point, it's got to okay. become FaceTime. Me and Frank will do more when we're together than if we're just pals on Facebook. So, okay. Well, so, I want I'm, I'm, I want to invest with you, and I will invest with you. But obviously, I'm uh, I'm quite a distance away from that. And good. have I and have I done? Have I been through uh, Cardone University? No, and I know that that's a one thing that you must have in order to affiliate with yourself and your team. So that's going to be done. I am going to buy my growth con ticket today. I have read the uh, the millionaire booklet. And, and, and by the, by the way, hey, what Frank's going to give you is going to help you. The second thing I was going to tell you about like the opportunity zone thing, that it, how do you connect with those, the right people? The, the information he's going to give you for 50 grand, he's given it to you, is going to help you get known in your space. 
Okay. If I don't know you, I can't flow you. That doesn't mean I meet you one time. It means I know you and then I pop up again in your feed and again in your feed and again in your feed. And then finally I'm like, I submit. Omnipresence, baby. Okay. Yes. Yes. So, well, I'm, I will, uh, how will I, how will I receive that grant? Yeah. You'll, you'll, you'll hook up with Natalie right now. You just need to call my office, buy your seat, confirm your seat, reserve your seat. And yep. then let us know, and then Frank will deliver the package. So someone from your team will give us a the, spreadsheet, the and then we'll yep. send the username yep. and password to my members area. Yeah. That might be till Monday, by the way, because yeah, it's yeah. Friday. Give him till so Monday. He's in it. Miami, so yeah. he'll get it to you on Monday. 100% money-back guarantee on everything he gave you, by the way. 100% of the zero money it cost you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. If it doesn't work, he'll give you 100% of your money back. Yeah. 100% of the 54000 that you didn't spend. And I'm going to write a $100 check. In your name to honor.org today. Honor.org. I like honor. that. I got to check that out. Help okay. an organization. We uh, need help, man. Person. Come on. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you got Kyron in Indiana. Kyron, what's going on in Indiana? They definitely need to network there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, it's uh, pretty bad networking out here. Yeah. Um, yeah, that, you guys kind of just uh, answered my main question of uh, Uncle G. I'm only like 19 and I'm just getting started in this kind of uh, path to like building uh, building up my network and income. Um, but just so far, listening on the call, man, I already pulled the trigger. I made the decision, man, I'm going to be out there in Miami for the growth con. Boom. Dude, I don't care what you guys got to do, man. You got to, no matter what, there's no situation that you could tell me, I can't get off work. Good, then, you know, I'd quit the job. I mean, I would tell you. I don't think anyone's coming to growth con so they can be like, I hope I can stay in this job I don't like a little bit longer. A anybody you know? that won't let you get 60-day advance notice to come improve your life on a Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, that's not a job you need to stay in. Mm -mm. And, no. and if, right. three days, if three days out of 365 days screws you up, then you're just telling me Bill, what Bill Gates, Steve, uh, Steve uh, what's his name? Uh, Jobs? No, he's not, he's not networking anymore. <laughs> Uh, Harvey, Bill, Warren, Jeff Bezos, all the pl power players, the Sheryls, all, all the hitters. Dude, these people, their time is worth a lot more than yours and mine, and they still make time to do this. Steve Ballmer, yeah. Come on, man. I was just waiting to give you the opportunity to say. I can't desecrate uh, Mr. Yeah. Apple, okay? Uh, uh, you, you guys got to figure it out. You just got to commit. How, how important is it to commit? Well, if you don't but, have it, you got nothing. Yeah. Without commitment is bullshit. What if you were still in Macon, Georgia, dude? I'd probably be working in a car lot, making 60 grand a year. Miserable AF, you know. And yeah. when, we, uh, when I decided What's to AF move, as fuck, I just keep oh, thinking, I, I keep forgetting I can talk normal. I never know. I didn't know what yeah. the AF stands Yeah, I'm trying, like, to, I'm trying to keep that? it clean, but I'm, I, don't, I don't have to. after Frank? Is that after Frank? That could be. Yeah, that could be. No one's miserable AF after Frank. No, man. Yes, yeah, so I wouldn't be doing too well. You know, when we moved to California, I made the decision. Like, at, I said, I cannot raise my children in this environment. We're going now. Got on a plane, flew out within 48 from Georgia, hours Georgia. from Georgia. Uh -huh. Never been uh -huh. to San Diego before, ever in my mm -hmm. life. Like, okay, we're moving. 90 days later, house sold, new place, gone. Same thing with Miami. Natalia and I were like, it's time to go to Miami. We're going. The end. That's it. That's the other that's thing. It. The, the, the moves, when I move and travel, I always get better. Yeah. And, you know, I think a lot of people, like, <clears throat> they look at the money. I know I was brought up to pay atten more attention to the money, save your money, save your money. The, the experiences I've had traveling the planet are worth so much more than the money. Like, uh, you know, I think people, they don't travel. Like, 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 like you're, you literally have one page. If, if the world is a big book... Most people only have one, the first page or the first chapter of the book read because the travel, man, you meet people. And you get out of the, you get out of the same old, same old, yeah, it makes yeah. your brain think differently. Uh, I don't know about you, man, but on a plane or in that environment where I'm not on Wi-Fi or whatever, I come up with some of the best stuff. Oh, yeah. Just with a notepad and pen. Yeah. So like you're, we, you're thinking, we, oh, man, I got Wi-Fi. Yeah. Well, you know, turn that shit off, man. You can no, come up with some schemes. Yeah, but y'all yeah. are worried about the travel. Dude, that's an opportunity to sit down and map out what do I want to accomplish this year? How am I going to do it? Why? Come, you come into the 10X uh, Growth Con with a game plan just from the travel to the Growth Con by itself. Marlin Stadium. Okay, I told Derek Jeter, I said, we're going to have more winning 
in this stadium in three days than you've had in three years. <laughs> Sorry, DJ. Okay. How'd that go over? Okay. He's like, yeah, you're right, man. Uh-huh. I already wrote him a check, so he's happy. Shit, he's going to make more money, too, than he's ever made on the Marlins. All right? Okay, next caller. By the way, make sure these people get a seat. Otherwise, I'm never talking to you guys again, ever. I'm done. I just cut a bunch of people off from Facebook yesterday. I said, I'm done with you. Out. Okay, you don't talk to me. You don't connect with me. You don't communicate with me. If you just sit there and watch, okay, I'm done with you. I'm done. And you got Neil in Texas. Delete yourself before I do it. I'm, I'm going to get some new people, man. We're pruning. We're Neil pruning. in Texas. Don't mess with Texas. You're, you're going to miss the Bougainvillea when you get here, though. The Bougainvillea and freaking Dude, we have, Cali is so beautiful. I know. We planted we planted tons of it. It's going all up the house. You know, yeah, you got to cut it. it. You got to cut it, dude. Well, I ain't going to cut nothing. I'm going to cut my ass yeah, up yeah. out of here. I'm going to come he, here. He rents. He takes my real estate advice, by the way. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, go ahead, man. What's up? No, hey, Grant. I just want to say thank you, man. I'm from Lubbock, Texas, man. Uh, you made me uh, help me start my second business. So uh, I just want to thank you from the bottom of my heart, man. Uh, but, uh. I guess I'm speechless pretty much. Uh, gosh, do I get the – I, I want to get some tickets. I want some tickets. Dude, grab some seats right now. Frank Kern's going to give you his entire legacy package of, of uh, the, the genius net, – uh, not networking, the, the genius advertising. Literally, the guy the – guy, what, what was the show, the advertising Number one movie? in the world, What was baby. the advertising movie on TV that was so famous? Uh, you Mad mean the show Men. Mad Men. Yeah, yeah. The Mad Men was made about him. I don't know if y'all know that. <laughs> it was not actually made about him. It was. Yeah. Stop it, man. Yeah. Quit lying It was you. made about dudes that weren't quite as good as me. Oh. Yeah. Oh. They, they didn't have the advantages I got. That's okay. why. Yeah. Get this guy some seats, all right? Get this guy some seats. Find out what he can afford. Okay, the website's 10xgrowthcon.com, 10xgrowthcon.com, 10xgrowthcon.com. What's the website? 10xgrowthcon.com. Yeah. Frank Kern's going to give you $50,000 worth of his training for anyone that buys a seat today. So buy whatever seat you want, grab whatever's left, okay? Pick where you want to uh, uh, sit. It's gonna be a great conference, folks. I promise you it'll be great. This is good till midnight? Absolutely. I'll and get 100 all- bucks to honor.org in your name. That's a big deal. That's a charity, that's a charitable yep. donation in, on, on your behalf. Um, so go to the website, grab your seat. This is good till midnight. Frank will send you a confirmation Monday or Tuesday of next week. Thank you for being in the Cardone Zone, remember, your net worth is your damn net worth. You ain't going to have no net worth without a net worth. Dude, if you got money problems, quit looking for the money and look for the people. You need to be around the first people, the right people, okay? So churches are great places. Charity events are great places. Uh, community events. It's not at home. You're not going to change 2019 from your bedroom. Netflix is not going to help you. Facebook and Instagram, looking at it all day, is not going to increase your net worth. It's game time, man. How, how important is the end of the year to you, Frank? Like, it's just huge. last 20 days. It's huge. And the beginning of the year. To yeah. me. That's usually when we have our biggest yeah. months. Yeah. And it's, a, it's part of a psychological thing, I think. It's like, shit, man, the years, and then let's go, let's hit it. Right, and then right. in the beginning, it's like, it's a new year, yeah. let's hit it. But now's the time. And what, what I don't think people realize that are on the fence about this, which would be insane, is that any event, you'll see this as you keep doing more events, the last six weeks coming up to the event, that's when everybody starts registering. So you can yeah, sell this yeah. thing out in a matter of days or we're weeks. Clo- we're close right now. Yeah. So it's so, like, don't be screwing around and waiting. Like you say, worry about your airfare. Worry dude, about the hotel all- later. Just get a damn ticket. Get you, your ass down You guys are going there and you're going to buy the ticket and you're like, wait, I got to go check my, ha- my hotel out. No, no, you don't. You're doing it in the wrong order. What you got to do is commit first. You commit first, then airfares, hotels, and all that other stuff take care of themselves. Senior data, right? I got 20 days left in the year. I'm going to pound these 20 days so hard so that when January 1st happens, dude, I already got momentum. Momentum. It's like I'm moving into, I'm already going 300 miles an hour. Don't slow down right now. Start working on your network. Grab your seat. Join our Facebook pages. Start talking about 10X and the people that are going to show up in Miami. You can literally network with those people rest of the year and all of January so that when you get here, you guys are already going to be doing some Promagation? What's that good. sexual term? Promagulation? Propagation? Some, some, you start doing the, the business. You start doing the business. <laughs> you, <said penetration. laughs> you start doing the business. Like, well, you got to, you got to, <laughs> hey, dude, this is what you got to do. You got to fertilize. Right? Okay. Any, any civilization that does not reproduce will cease to exist. 
Bottom line. Got to connect up. Use your money so it can have babies. More money. I'm back to that. Got to use money. It's got to fertilize. The whole point of any business, aside from the obvious, which is to deliver on promises and help people, is to multiply capital. Yeah. You shouldn't view this uh, this event as an expense, which incidentally, good God, dude, I mean, it ain't no damn money. I can't. It's like we're we're trying to sell like a freaking you know fifty thousand dollar investment. It's a couple hundred bucks for three days of education, networking, Tax deductible, by the way. He's given 100 plus his $50,000 program and it's tax deductible this year, even though you don't go till next year. It's a no-brainer. If you're a business owner and Frank's your employee, rather than giving Frank a, 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 huh? a bonus this year, give him this. He doesn't pay taxes on the income, on the, on the gift. Because that's a non-taxable gift uh, uh, event, and you get to write it off. It's a double win for the employer. All right? Did you know that? I did not. But I was just telling I was like, that's what we should do for our team. Well, the other thing is I was thinking about you this morning is you, you need to look at what you're, what you're moving, what moving expenses and research Huge. to move yeah. uh, uh, are included on your trip over out here. Oh, all of it. You might, well, no, but you might be able to include like the first six months of a rental. Hot damn. Researching. Mm-hmm. So maybe don't sign a lease at the first place. Mm. Do six months and say, I'm not sure about that place. I know we did it for about four weeks over at the, the Ritz. No kidding. On, the, on Key Biscayne because I was researching. Right so yeah. we, and we bang. You can't write off anything on, 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 on uh, like last night. You can't. Don't even throw that on there. All right. That's all gone. They wiped that out. <laughs> Okay. They got it. I, I, They've done got dude, it. Dude, I, 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 know, I, know like, I know almost every little tax freaking uh-huh. glitch. Okay, and that's the kind of people you want to be around. By the way, one of the reasons Steve Harvey's coming in is he wants to spend some time talking to me about how I navigate the tax space. He's like, hey, man, don't you want to meet him? Yeah, I'd he's love to meet him. He's a cool dude, man. Yeah. He's, he's like, hey, man, how you pay less taxes than I do, man? That's what I want to know. That's a, I want to know, too. I pay more than half. Step one, I guarantee don't you, live in California. I guarantee you paid way more taxes than I did. Okay. Well, I, 14% even more take, at least. Even take out that, mm-hmm. and you still did. You paid more federal than I did, too. Oh, man. I, I mean, I, I what, was do your my federal, part. what was your federal last year, you know? Uh, dude, I know that we pay more than half. Like, literally more than half. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, like, millions a year yeah, in taxes. Yeah, like, yeah. just write the check. I do it in, amount of, in like how many phantoms? Mine was zero. Yeah. You know why I was zero? Because I spent millions of dollars getting around people that play at a level so high. I'm like, what are you doing there? What are you doing there? Why'd you buy that? Why'd you buy this? Those guys know the game. You got to spend the money, cross your fingers, bust your ass in 2019, which is another way to support crossing the fingers. And dude, dude you, you got to get around the right people, though. You got to have people to do some great business with. Okay, again, 10xgrowthcon.com. Frank Kern's going to give you his $50,000 worth of the programs. Expires do it today. At midnight. Urgency is all Expires in my face. At midnight. No drinking tonight. No smoking the blunt tonight, okay? No going to strip joints tonight. None of the craziness. You guys got to put your head down right now, okay? No blunt till the end of the year. Let me write a check in your name to the Honor Foundation to help the Navy SEALs. Yeah, Come let on, him man. do that. Let's do Have it. your seat. Write it off this year. My name's Grant Cardone. This is Frank Kern, and this is the Cardone Sound. Hello. Your net worth, son. Go borrow money. Damn it, go borrow money. What are you guys thinking about, man? You're wasting, you're wasting time. Friday through Sunday, you need to figure out what else you're going to do other than strip joints and, and bars. Like me and Jared stay so busy. Yeah. We're working so much. We're like, we don't have time for, to waste time. How many times you been to church? Zero. Charity events? Zero. Country clubs? Zero. Bank meetings? Bank meetings, zero. Uh, seminars? Zero. Uh, conferences? Zero. How much money's in your bank? Zero. There you go, bro. Your network you. is your net worth, son. Go borrow money.
nights that you will never, ever forget. My name's Grant Cardone. This is the Cardone Zone. Every day, every day, every day. Every I'm gonna show you how to get money a lot cheaper than this. Hey, get yourself in a position to sit in that chair right there. Are you the solution or are you the problem? Yeah, well, we're talking about what does it take? They don't know you and they're not thinking about you. They, they do you. know you and they're not thinking about they you. They forgot you. Yeah. My name's Grant Cardone. You are in the Cardone Zone where I wake you up, I shake you up, I punch you in the face, but mostly, I'm that good uncle. What's happening, Greg? Yeah, what's happening, man? You got a deal or you got a question? Yeah.